welcome back again to my youtube channel so i want to talk about something that we all like to talk about we all want to hear abroad <laughs> okay not we all most people in africa my fellow country people we like abroad yes now before i continue this video i want to say if you see my face for the first time and you have not subscribed and you are just here watching this video you clicked on it please help me subscribe and press that button and also turn on your bell so when i post videos other videos good videos now you will like them so you will be the first to know <laughs> all right so and to my amazing returning subscribers what can i do without you guys the ones that keep coming back again and again to watch my videos god bless you so much now abroad is good oh living abroad is interesting there is light good road security the system at least it works abroad is not easy there are really some harsh realities about abroad that we should talk about too before i moved abroad hmm, you don't want to know what i thought about abroad you don't want to know <laughs> But when I came in, I was heartbroken. I was like, is this how you guys live here? Like these people walk their ass out. They pay for everything. Now let me say we because I'm not part of them. We pay for everything. You see poo poo, poo poo that you poo poo. And in Nigeria, you just build your sock away in your compound and you don't have to pay. Here, we pay for it. Waste water. We pay for it. Water that is waste, we pay for it. The only thing we don't pay for abroad, ah, is it light? That one is normal. Now, when you stop paying your light, your light will go off. Is the air that we breathe in that we don't pay for. For every single euro you earn, every single dollar we earn, we work. And even some working conditions are not good, but what can we do? We have to hold on to it. Or is it the help that we don't have? When we turn left and right, there is no father or mother or brother or sister to turn to. Abroad is really lonely for some immigrants. The weather. Hmm. People that lives, live in the Scandinavia area. If I pronounce this way, that's the very cold regions like Norway, Finland, those really cold regions. People even in Canada, it's really, really not easy for them. Coming from um, a weather where it's okay and then you come to the cold, it's really not easy. And then lastly, let's talk about the racism. No matter how much many of those countries tend to like, oh, we are said black, we are black friendly. It's not totally true. We still experience racism in these countries that we live in. There are really some of them that will never ever accept you. Even our children face it in schools. We are stigmatized. Some places of opportunity that you can all oh, abroad is not easy. We work. We are doing two jobs three jobs just to meet up and then we are living a double life we are living here and we're also living in Nigeria because we are trying to live here and also do things back home so you can imagine the stress that people go through here abroad no is you but I'm not saying that you should not come if you have an opportunity to move abroad move come abroad you too you will see the reality of it because i know some people will be like oh if it's not easy why don't you come back home yes i'm not saying it's not good but it's not all that glitter that is good it's not as easy as how you think from where you are until you come then you will really really know the difference <laughs> all right guys Thank you so much for watching till this time. If you have not liked my video, please like it, like it, like it. <laughs> I'll see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.